Yo, what's going down, Commanders? Hope you're all doing well for, on this. I keep wanting want to say Friday, but it's not. It's Thursday night. Um, I've got the new. This is level one. The Krug. I'm going to test it in PVE. I'm not going to worry about it too much until I've got it higher up in levels to go into PVP. I just want to see what sort of damage it does. What 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 is it all about? Is it an improvement on the last unique we got? Who knows? Let's have a find out. Right, for a start, I do want to check to see if it's got any splash. So I'm going to hit that building there. Not even shoot. Oh, it has got a bit of splash. And a missile. A big missile. That that weren't on it before when I used it. I'm going to go up there a little bit further. I just want to target that before I go after the the units. It's very slow, though. Is it is it as good as the Juggernaut when it come out first come out? My answer would be probably not. The Juggernaut was the the boss of all units, in my opinion. Is this going to be an, an improvement on that, or is it just kicked I throwing out another unique that's no good to no one? Oh, I've got about them units coming towards me. It looks like it kind of misses some units because of the way the missile shoots. If I back off a little bit... Three shots to kill one of them big tanks. I think this gets two missiles at, at level... 11. Elite. And then three at 30. Or, tw sorry, 20. 21. Right, so we've killed that. We've took really no damage. It's just so slow. It might be a useful unit for some of the lowers in, in the event, as long as there isn't a unit that can outrange it. That's what I'm thinking. It's slow, but you might be able to get some of the event bases done. Oh, it smokes them. Let's see if I can S-key that. Yeah, I can. Right, I'm going to aim for that that power plant, see if I can kill that bunker, see if it can outrange that bunker. See what happens. If it kills the bunker, it, it flash kill it. Go on, S-key. Yeah, S-key works well with this, guys. Against kicks eye units. S-key. I'm going to hit that now. I think it's 750 range, was it? I'm not 100%. I might be wrong. I will have to check. But it looks about 6, 750 to me. My only problem here is... Is can I kill, splash kill that? What sort of distance is the splash on it? It might be a good farming unit. I'm going to say, now with the right tech, this could be a lot of fun. Will it splash kill it? No. So there, there's the sort of the ranges before that distance. I don't think that turret was anti-splash. I may be wrong. Kill him. Can it shoot air? Is another question. Can it shoot the floaters? Kill these. I think these have got quite a big range, so we'll be yeah, look. I'm going to get smoked. They didn't really do much damage to him, though. Them things normally do quite a lot of damage. I think the shell has to hit you, though. But can it? It cannot hit floating. That kind of screwed it. So the missile's grand only by looks of it, similar to what the jug was. This is the problem I've got now. I'm going to have to bring in air. Help me out a little bit. Let's see what, what we're up against. Let's see what the splash range is on. I want to see if it kills that. It should do. Hopefully. No. Terrible. Very slow going. I'm going to need two hits. Do you know what? I don't even think I've started Shadow Ops. That's horrible. Why isn't that giving that... Is that anti-splash tur that turret? I'm not sure. Have a look. Hmm. I don't know what's going on there. It may be an anti-splash turret. I need to check. 
two days. Then that one. Get ready with the SK. Hit the SK. See if it kills that. It does. Yeah, the SK is perfect for this unit, by the way, guys. Absolutely perfect. If only it moved a little bit faster. I've got a feeling them, them turrets, them platforms are anti-splash. Because uh, I just would have assumed that would have splash killed that. Two missiles probably will. Because, oh, it did splash kill it. That distance. On it, air. I've got to go up against this bunker. Does it outrange this bunker? All the questions you want answering. It doesn't. But it does splash kill air if you hit close. I wonder if I can splash kill that. I'm going to aim for this and, and, and more to the point to CC. Right there. It, I think it would have killed that. Had they not had the uh, absorption turret on it. I'm going to go in. Oh, kill that. Get, get out of my way. And I'm just going to shoot this. I don't think it outranges. Oh, that killed it though. Yep, get him out of there. Nope. So it's got, I'm a little bit unstuck now because I'm caught in the point where it's between the. What do I go for? We'll kill that turret there. How long have we got left? Three seconds. Okay, I'll end this attack. Make sure no one's going to snipe me too. No, right, I just want to start the shadow ops. Wait, oh, got that. Repeat. As you can see, I haven't even got 10 coin in my account. Once kicks, I start putting some good stuff in the game. I will put some coin. But the stuff that they have been putting in the game just lately has been bad. So I'm a, I'm a bar damage on it so far. I am going to kill it off, by the way, guys. I'm going to literally kill this unit off. And what I'll do is I'll, uh, we'll have a look at the repair time in basic. I don't know what base would kill this off, to be fair. Anything over. The, the, the uniques need to be reduced drastically in repair time. In my opinion, anything over two hours is way too much for something that they ain't putting much effort into. Right. I want to know if I can kill that. Uh, if I hit that. No. What about if I hit that? No. Okay. But fuck it, I'm going to have to run sank in just to kill these turrets. Actually, yeah, no, I do want to finish this base. As I say, I want to kill the unit off, so let's just put him on fist. See what happens. Ruby on. Um, I'm trying to think what base would kill this on the map pretty quickly. I've got to repair logistics, that don't matter. See what the repair time is on it. It's a very slow unit, but if you have got it, and you can still get the parts now, guys, there's no excuse not to have the parts. Uh, metal space, kill it, reckon? I'm going to run this straight through the centre of the metal, uh, the metal space, see what happens. I'm going to run it straight down there. See how long it lasts. I know it doesn't last too long in, in PvP, that's for sure. Sorry if you can hear buzzing noise. I've got a fan on. It's super hot today. Hardly taking any damage. Oh, holy crap. 
let's, let's get it to shoot. Shoot that. That should splash kill a lot. Uh, the splash ain't that good on it. It's, it's an improvement to what we see in the go-go bar previously, that's for sure. Speaking of pummeling, but this base is, is, is dated now. It's not, it's not an up-to-date base. It does kill air, so if you hit something below it, below the air, it will kill, splat, the splash will kill it. Come on. Taking a fucking whooping, I can tell you that much. Still, still ain't worth two, any more than two hours repair. At all. Get more shit firing at it. There he goes, he's dead. Let's go have a look at the repair time, eh? I think I've been waffling on long enough. I don't want to bore you guys to tears. Right, so... Where is it? We're coming home. And my game's lagging. Yeah, big time. Right, there it is. It's a six hour thirty two repair. Way too much repair time. Two hours is, is perfect for a good unique. Any longer is just it's just a con. Seventeen coins to, to coin it from dead. But as I say, we have got the these things, unique repair logistics. I'm not even gonna bother using it on it. I'm not gonna waste it. I'm not gonna use anything else in PvE at the minute, because kicks I don't put anything on the map worthy of my time maybe a little bit more shadow ops but i can do that free repair yeah um it's an interesting unit it needs a little bit more speed it, they're trying to give it the juggernaut 2.0 where it's the just the area of effect once it hits its shot it's not it's not, not a juggernaut it is a carbon copy of the juggernaut of old though just a bit more range less splash Anyway, guys, I'd love to know what you think about the unit. Let me know in the comment section below. Have a good discussion about it. Where do you stand? Is, it, is the repair time fair? Or do you think it's a rip-off like me? Do you think the unit's going to be any good? See you later, guys. Bye-bye.